everyone welcome back to my channel this is Jenny and today I have a pretty good sized Dollar Tree haul to share with you everything I picked up is brand new so let me dive in and let me show you on what I purchased so I'm gonna start off with these stackable containers these are adorable so let me start with this one so it does not have the size but it's just called container and it has a lid that it goes on really tight look how cute that is so it has little cups of hot cocoa in that so you put the lid on there and then it has this little knob what you do is take another one and stack it right on top so that one has santa a reindeer snowman and some trees and then you have the gingerbread house and gingerbread look how cute those are these are so cute and make really cute gifts um that'd even be cute to put like tinsel or something in there put like three different gift cards and like put a big ribbon around it and give it as a gift hey there's joe hey jojo hi jojo birdie jojo birdie. okay moving on they have um some stencils well, I've had stencils, but they have a, quite a few new ones. I just picked up two, and these are by Crafter Square. So I went ahead and picked up that one and the one that has different words. Now, the ones that they used to carry like this said self-adhesive. So I'm not sure if these are self-adhesive. No, they're not. They are not adhesive self-adhesive that is but I like how rubbery kind of they are so they'll be easier to clean but you might want to cut out the words separately and make sure you clean them off fairly quickly after you're done using them I was wondering why it didn't self say self-adhesive because it's not you know okay moving on um they have really cute gift boxes and birthday boxes and for any occasion but these are just so adorable it says birthday wishes and it has it's like a shaker the little stuff moves around in there it's kind of hard to show you but inside ooh, something in there so there's inside the box so how cute is that i have let's see ava's birthday is December 22nd and then Grace's birthday is December 30th and then Sam's is January 12th and my mom's December 16th so I'll use this for one of their birthdays um their patches I've been hauling their patches every time I find a new pack I buy them um, I'm gonna start sticking them probably on my laptop and Ava's been sticking them on hers now these are iron-ons but you can use glue or tape if you want so this one's new um, I have always found these on those plastic strips. Always be sure you check those every single aisle because you never know what you're going to find. And I always find some really cool stuff on those strips. Um, I hauled the placemats of this. And so when I seen the towel and the hot pads and the oven mitt, I was like, yay. But I did not need the oven mitt because I never use oven mitts, but I use these. These are actually my husband's favorite, the Dollar Tree ones, because they're thin and you can grab the stuff. So look how cute that is. And then you have the matching towel. Oh, love it. I love this print. I love the colors. Um, more goodies from over there in the uh, party goods and wedding um, items this is new now this is probably gonna be like a seasonal thing so once it's gone it's gone look at this so if you have a wedding coming up or whatever and you want these for your wedding to put on guest tables or up by the food and you can put mints and candies in there this will be perfect now I bought this I'm gonna try to do a DIY with it if not I'm gonna keep it up um, to put candy in it because I always have candy in the house because I love my candy and my chocolate I have to have it you would have thought I would be pregnant around the clock every day of every year because I'm always craving chocolate. But these are so cool how it comes in three. Three. Like three snowballs. Okay. And then another item that's over there is this. 
How adorable is this? You can do so many things with this, you guys. I have some ideas. I'm gonna be doing multiple DIYs with a lot of these containers because it is endless. Last year around Christmas time, I did a, quite a few different ones. If I can find that video, I will link it down below. If not, you can always go to my playlist. Who's that? Oh, Ella, that's Ella May. Um, click onto my playlist, go to my Dollar Tree DIYs, and that should pull up uh, all up. I think there's like 66 or 67 of them. I'm not quite sure. But these are so cool. You don't have to use them for just food. Think outside the box. Okay, moving on. How adorable is this? This is by Christmas House. It is a scarf. It's a 46 and a half by 3 and a half. Little Santa scarf, but look on the end. Bells, 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 bells. Oh, oh, hi, May. Come here. Hi, Ella May. You want to say hi? Huh? You want to say hi, Mimi? Oh, why are you shaking? Why are you shaking? You're crying. You're interrupting me. But that's okay. You're okay. Why are you shaking? She always shakes. <laughs> Sit there with your sister. Okay. Let me take the scarf off. But how cute is that? I have never seen a Christmas scarf there like this with little bells. Ah, so cute. So I had to get it, of course. Um, Alka-Seltzer Plus. Day and night, severe sinus congestion and cough. Maximum strength. You get 12 day capsules and eight, well, I should say liquid gels. Now you tell me, what store other than the Dollar Tree that you can find this for one dollar? And the date it expires on is 720. Yeah, 2020. Yeah, huge thumbs up. This is like what eight bucks, nine bucks at Walgreens. Another item I am going to try. I'm kind of yeah. Um, but you get 20 small patches of pain relief patch, that is extra strength medicated patch. Interesting. So, I am going to, oh, this has a date on it too. 04 of 2022. Oh, they got scissors. <laughs> I have to prepare it again. It's so scary. Okay, so, they look like band-aids. Are they band-aids? Ooh. Oh my. Ooh, I don't know if I want to smell like that. What's that smell like? Some kind of gum. It smells like gum. Some kind of peppermint, mint gum. But this is what it looks like. It looks like almost like a gauze pad. I could read the directions, but you know, that would just take me too long. I can't figure you out. Well, I'm probably doing this wrong. Wow, that really smells. I wonder if that's really going to make you, like, if you walk by someone, they'll be like, ooh, Bengay. That's what it smells like. Bengay and mint. That's what it smells like. So I'll have to read the directions and blah, blah, blah. Clean and dry affected area. Move patch from film. Apply to direct area no more than three to four times daily. Do not wear patch for more than eight hours. Okay. Although I would need it for my back. I would have to probably put all 20 of those on my back. Oh, get how about some Relief Soothing Oatmeal Bath Treatment? 100% natural oatmeal compared to Aveeno. Active ingredient. Um, it's act, um, effective relief of itches and rashes due to poison ivy, oak, um, eczema, insect bite, and sunburn. Six single-use packets. Fragrance free. So I thought since my husband has eczema, and it really gets bad on his foot in the winter and his lower leg. Oh, so look at this. It looks like real passive oatmeal. Don't mistake it. So that is what the packets look like. And I am just going to go ahead for the fun of it, cut a little slip just to get a whiff to make sure it, ooh, fragrance free. All I can smell is freaking Bengay. Yeah, doesn't have smell. So, they're telling the truth. So, this was over by the bath bombs and all that good stuff. And this was over by the band-aids. And this is with all the other medicine. 
but always be sure you check the end caps because I have been noticing a lot of cold medicines on the end caps because tis the season to get sick. I picked up one of each color, a blue and pink. This is the facial cleansing brush. Battery operated facial cleansing tool removes dirt, oil, and makeup, gently exfoliates, and unclogs pores. Requires two AA batteries that are not included. But you know what? It's scary, I know, but I brought two AA batteries. We are going to pop open this blue one. It has low and high speed. We're going to slap these batteries in here and we are going to see, go in there. We should be playing music for you guys, like elevator music. Okay, so we're gonna go low. Oh, it's like I'm at the dentist. <laughs> Hmm. I'm gonna use that for like a shoe polish or something. I don't know. Oh, I just took some of my makeup off. Well, it takes the makeup off. Well, I don't have a whole lot on, but it does work. So I just wonder how well it, like, does it make your face wash fizzy? I don't know. Comment down below and let me know if you bought one of these and let me know how it works. Very interested to know if it works. One last fun item that I picked up is more of this uh, dish soap. Radiant and Fresh Clean Passion Fruit and Mandarin. And it is the 18 ounce. They normally carry the 10 ounce. So this really did smell really good. I am set with dish soap for quite some time because I think I've bought five different ones of these now. So I am set. So that my subby friends is everything that I bought at my Dollar Tree. So I hope I was able to show you something that maybe you can go find at one of your local stores. I'm going to ask you guys a really fast question. The first one to comment the correct answer will win this Time Garden Week at a Glance Coloring Diary book. The question is, what are the names of all five of my human Kids, first one to comment the correct answer will win this book. So I just want to say thank you all for taking the time out of your day to sit down and watch my video. So if you enjoyed this video, I would love a thumbs up. Be sure you click on to that subscribe button if you haven't already, because I'd really love to have you as a subby friend. I thank you all for stopping by and spending the time with me today like I did a few seconds ago that I just told you that. It's just habit. So I hope you have a wonderful, beautiful day, and I will see you in my next video. Bye, guys. Keep smiling. Bye. Everyone's just running different ways. It's <laughs> really stressing me out. Supermarket sweep. Where's Ava? That's what I, I think. I don't know. know. She might be. No, she might be trying on jeans. Okay. She's trying on the jeans. We need to sign this contract. I know. What contract? Huh. Yeah. I don't think we both lost. I'm not gonna get this anymore, so I'm gonna get away. Oh, oh. I love this. Oh yeah, that's cute. And a planner. You got sage? Why you got sage? Because size I found. You're going to have to try them on because you I normally can't. wear double zeros. I know. I can't find... Ooh. Okay, so before we pick a winner for today's giveaway, I wanted to announce the winner from Friday's video. I asked you five questions and whoever answered the five questions correctly was going to win this box of goodies. And the answers to the questions, the first one was, what are the breeds of my dogs? And it was French Bulldog and Boston Terrier. The second question, how many brothers or sisters do I have? I have two brothers. 
What is my favorite TV show or movie? My TV show is Friends and the movie was Notebook. And what was the title of my very first YouTube video, which is titled um, Where's My Binky? And then what do I tell you at the end of all my videos, which is Keep Smiling? So I made a mistake with one um, guess, and it was um, Santos Ramirez. Um, unfortunately, her title wasn't fully correct but I am going to send you um, a gift because it was my mistake. So please email me your address. And also the um girl, I will put her, the screenshot up there as well. I will be sending you a little something as well because you had two guesses. Um, so the, the grand prize winner for this box is Betty Lauer. So congratulations, Betty, for winning this. Please email me your address and I will put my email right up here. So with that said, I'm going to go ahead and have my son draw another winner out of the box. And today we're going to be giving away this brand new wind chime. This is a beautiful, beautiful wind chime. So Alex, you know the drill. I'm going to go ahead and give this a, another stir. The winner has 48 hours to contact me to claim your prize. If you ever want to be entered in any of my giveaways, here is my P.O. Box information. So, Alex, go ahead. Let's see who is going to be winning the wind chime. He's going deep on that one. And that is, is it Mara Garcia? So, congratulations. You are the winner for the wind chime. Again, I just want to say thank you to all of you for all the wonderful, beautiful smiley mail that I opened along with the wonderful happy birthday wishes. So I hope you all have a wonderful, beautiful Sunday, and we will see you in our next video. Bye. Bye, guys. Keep smiling.